What's going on guys, it's Jack here. Welcome back for another NBA Draft Profile. Remember to follow me on Twitter at NBA Draft Wiz for more great NBA Draft content. Now checking out the senior from Iowa State today, Monte Morris, who will be 22 by the time the NBA season rolls around. He's 6'3", the 6'5", wingspan, 175 pounds, so he's got the size you need at the point guard position. And as a guy who I've watched for all four years at Iowa State from his days with Georges Niang to playing with Naz Long and Deontay Burton, and is just the prototypical point guard, he doesn't turn the ball over. He does not turn the ball over. Over In three of his four seasons at Iowa State, he led the nation in assist to turnover ratio with a career rate at 465. Those are Chris Paul numbers, folks. And, and I just, you know, just appreciate that because players who, who just don't turn the ball over like that are, are just so rare. I mean, you know, the, the MVP campaigns this past season from Russell Westbrook and James Harden, while well, they had the ball in their hands all the time. You know, they turn the ball over a ton. And, and so you got to appreciate a point guard who just does not make mental mistakes on the basketball court. And that is why, to me, Monte Morris is a guy who, while he'll be selected in the second round, has a chance to surprise people at the next level and at the very least come out as a solid backup point guard prospect. Now, Morris, you know, he, he shot 38% from three and definitely upped his scoring, especially after Niang left. And he's got a great basketball IQ and, and good feel for the game. He's very calm and steady, and that's the only way you can average such few turnovers. you got to be very sure of yourself, but at the same time, he's not timid. He, he's not afraid to get into the teeth of the defense and attack and penetrate and dish. And so Morris has a lot of things going for him at the next level. Now, what he does need to improve on, though, is his scoring efficiency. While a decent three-point shooter at 38% from the college three, you would have liked him to see him hit over 40%, especially since he didn't shoot that many, only four attempts per game. Now, Morris also, you know, he doesn't have, he's not a great athlete, only a 32-inch uh, max vertical at the combine, and, you know, a player who, who wasn't known for his athleticism throughout his career, and, you know, I, I think that, you know, he doesn't have that first step quickness, but he's heady, he's smart, and he's able to use changes of, of speed and really um, just just know he's got a, a nice quality to his game where he knows how to attack the defense um, at times. Now, without that first step quickness, without that elite athleticism, better NBA defenders, bigger NBA defenders are going to be able to guard him and keep him under check. And so Morris is going to become need to become better off ball and just uh, improve his efficiency, especially shooting off ball threes, catch and shoot threes, as well as you know improving his floater uh, repertoire, that mid range area when he comes off the three point line, when he's forced off the three point line, he's just going to need to improve in, in that aspect, that that mid range, that mid area, um, and, and it is his efficiency there. And I think he will. Uh, he's too smart of a player for him not to Im improve in these areas. And I think you'll see a, a very, you know, advanced and, and polished player, especially in the summer league when he's up against some of these other higher profile prospects, but who don't have the polish that Morris has. And so I think you look at him and I see a player who could be like C.J. Watson, who is a very strong and solid backup for many years, still in the NBA, 10-plus year career, and just stuck around based on the fact that he's smart. Um, he plays good defense, and you know he's not a great athlete, but he shoots the three well enough, um, and, and just as a quality player who you want on your team, good locker room presence, and just a smart basketball player. Guys, let me know what you think about Monte Morris, what other prospects you want to see me profile in the comments below. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you're new for more great NBA and NFL draft content. Thanks, guys, for listening. I'm out.